One of the essential skills for a successful barista is milk pouring. Whether for a latte or a cappuccino, there are several basic steps to follow to ensure a beautiful pour every time. Let's get started. The first step after steaming the milk is called grooming. This involves tapping the pitcher on the counter to remove any bubbles. Then, keeping the pitcher on the counter, gently swirl it until the milk achieves a smooth, shiny appearance like wet paint. You may also want to groom the espresso as well by tapping out any bubbles and preparing a consistent canvas for your latte art. While holding the pitcher, keep a firm grip on it for control, but not so tight that it stiffens your movements. When pouring the milk into the espresso, it's best to think of it like diving into a pool. By tilting the cup, we create a deep end of the pool. Pour the milk in a steady, straight stream and gently swirl the espresso as the cup fills to about one half to two thirds full. After stopping briefly, resume pouring as close to the surface as possible. Pouring at a consistent speed, the foam will spread out into a round shape called a monk's head. When the cup is full, finish with a slight flick to create the trademark dimple. To turn a monk's head into a heart, finish by dragging a thin stream of milk all the way through the milk set. Finally, because cappuccino milk is foamier and less dense than latte foam, you will need to pour it higher and faster to achieve the same effect.